Hey everyone, so I wanted to make this uh, quick little video to show you how to upload your uh, transparent.png graphics. Uh, so I have one here. And uh, if I press the spacebar to preview, you can see that it is transparent because you can kind of see the background there, here. You can see that faint line and then some of this part too. That's how you know it's transparent um, if you're not too sure what dot pngs are so i'm gonna hit uh spacebar again and back into touchpix uh what you want to do is after you logged in you're gonna go back into designer so this is after you've already made your event the custom event whatever you mm -hmm. plan on doing and uh, depending on what size you made this one for or whichever graphic you're using um, you're going to go to templates and you're going to choose the size that you made it for so that's the first step so I made this one for slow-mo overlay number four and you can tell or if you're not too sure on the sizes if you go to uploads custom overlay it tells you the size dimensions here so you just type in those numbers and whatever you plan on using um, Photoshop uh, Canva. There's other softwares out there like uh, PhotoP. It's online free. But if you download these overlays as uh, templates, they're going to give you uh, .psd files, which are Photoshop. Uh, I'm not sure if you can use those in Canva, but uh, that's what the file types are: is uh, .psd. Um, but once you've selected your template, that's going to be the next step: is to go to Uploads and then go to Browse. So that way you can choose the graphic. Um, I want, it's going to be this one here. So now that it's popped up here, you know, you're wondering why isn't it popped up here? Well, all you have to do is just click on it. <laughs> and uh, after you've clicked on it and you're pretty much done, now you just need to add the template to whichever event. If you had multiple events here, you'll see the list here. And all you have to do is just uh, select which template to add it to or which event to add it to. And then you click on Add Template. So once I click Add Template, it's going to give me this adding, kind of like a little progress. And now Template Added. Then you're done. So that's pretty much it. Um, I can go over the three steps again. You go to Templates choose whichever template you made this for uh, then next go to uh, uploads browse for the overlay and then simply click on the graphic so that way it gets applied to this all right hope you found that uh, helpful and I'll see you in the next video